All right, time for some post-game. Now, when you load up the game the first time after you beat it, this final book uh, will appear like all the others, but since I did some off-screen stuff, we don't get to see that animation. But yeah, Wheel of Fate, that's basically the ending. And it does have a special intro like the others for when you first load it up. And we'll showcase that after the bonus dungeon. Now, I did put up a poll on who to use for the bonus dungeon. Mercedes won. So, I got her, her all prepped and ready for it. To access it, we just have to revisit her book. Now, this is accessible for every character after beating the game, but you do have to go to their epilogue chapter. Just gonna fly through here. I did get her to level 65 to unlock all her skills. I powered up a few of the Fozon abilities. Just the ones I'll be using. So, Churning Rift of the World. All enemies are level 50, so if you if you meet, if you match their level, they're not too bad, but I just wanted to unlock all the skills, showcase how powerful you are with them unlocked. But it is a it's a bit it's a bit of a marathon. Anyway, let's begin. Shoot the ocean. Oh, churning rift of the world. In this area, checkpoints do not exist, and you'll have no access to the item box. We recommend that you fully prepare before proceeding. So we have to do it all in one go. Now, if you do, if you lose, you don't get kicked out. I believe I, I've never lost it. But uh, one thing to do, I did, I did give Mercedes Maury's bell. So and I thought I had a nut brownie for her, but oh well. I'm just gonna. Let's build up her. Oh. Where was, where was the, where's the half eaten one? Eat that. Let's get her HP above the break a little bit. And there we go. That, yep, that's that's exactly double. If I need to heal up throughout, I've got more land bones, and they'll be good enough for the for this whole thing. Let's begin. So this is basically a boss rush. We're going to go against every mid-boss and boss fight the game has to offer. And fortunately, uh, since Mercedes does have critical heal, she is a she's a good choice for this. I will not be attempting to S rank every fight, though. There's no point. In the end, it's basically just a self-imposed challenge. Uh, I did upgrade, yeah, that one attack that uh, lets her jump. Ah, turn around, Mercedes. The sensor flying over, flying over the enemies, and you will get plenty of potions. But I also have several others that I've been stockpiling from various characters. It's a good idea to just use them. Let loose on everything against every boss. Utilize what they drop against them, because this will, this does take a while. And as usual, the round shot at the start is a very good way to dish out full damage, especially in close range. Uh, no thank you, I will have enough time to reload. Yeah, thank you for <laughs> thank you for just charging through the fire and keeping my chain going. I'm just so dizzy. Of course I don't want to s I don't want you to utilize my full on abilities too much. Simply because... Oh no, you don't. Yep. You take time to reload. I want him to heal, but sadly we got that off. Yeah, I'm saving certain potions for certain bosses. And since uh, I'm getting enemies to kill... That is allowing my foes on count to replenish. Oh yeah, nice juggle. Only because I ran out of ammo. That happened. Oh, no you don't. Before ya. Oh, I went too low. Stopped him from healing up again. And down he goes. So again, uh, rank really doesn't matter. I'm not even going to pick up a lot of items. Because 
Regardless of your rank, you get nothing. Oh, we just move on. And first up, be Lyle, since he was the first boss in the main game. Unfortunately, even, even with critical heal, I'm not actually healing simply because I'm above my HP max. Oh yeah, Blaze is a good one to use against Belial, especially if you hold still. Now, I did max out a few other abilities, especially the little summon ones. Uh, Manchi Call, Pixie Call, Spirit Call. So, she likes some of those. Those are mostly there to help keep your chain going. Do extra damage as that builds up. And against certain enemies, I will probably utilize is Brianna. Oh, well, you dove under the ground. There goes my chain. Got myself to the extra blaze, though. And here's the downside of keeping tabs on... If, if you're going for S-Ranks, yeah, the boss fights can definitely take a while. <laughs> but again, doesn't matter. It's a tough post challenge sort of thing. Okay. Oh. Place that toxin. Oh, you're going to try and suck me in. No, oh, the toxin! Oh, yeah, get poison from that. On the plus side, I didn't need to manually reload. Now the other good thing about this place is you will get a bunch of foes on. So if you need to build up skills and don't want to go into New Game Plus, this is a good, this is a good place to do so. Never that charge shots my power based abilities to finish him off. Oh, thought I got him. Oh come on! I'm I'm flying in midair here. Sucking for you. There, suck on that! Ha! Now, Belial is the only one you will face twice throughout this. I'm not counting the sorcerers who act as boss. Primarily because, yep, uh, him, him and Beldor do count as a separate boss entity, but she but also got to fight Scoldy, and they're basically, they're basically the same. I was running a test to see if I could get over get over him on that. Uh, I also maxed out spread shot, see how that does. Oh yeah. Uh, let me let me get in closer on that. Oh wreckage! Good one to use against large targets like this. Oh, I'll get behind you. I have a shortcut set for that. But, oh, yeah, I, I like that. Of course, the ground shot basically... Still does a, a bit more while tossing less, so... It, it looks impressive, but unfortunately the damage output is not as good as it, not as good as it looks. Plenty of hits, though, so a good way to build up the chain. I'm just gonna get on the... Get on the other side of him, reload, destroy the, those Charal Runes, and bam. That's dropped any potions I've noticed. Nope. I can spit those things on me. And one more for good measure. I'd rather take your Fozons. As for items, yeah, it probably won't hurt to pick up some. Uh, like, good for, good for cooking we can use later, but unfortunately more does not show up. Up next, Velvet! Real Velvet, not anyway. Yeah, this is still technically uh, Gwendolyn's series of enemies. 
So this is a, this is basically us versus Velvet at the story battlefield in Cornelius' story. <laughs> oh, wasn't quite out of range of that. Well, I don't want to ha have finished Painkiller anyway. Oh, yeah, Volcano was a decent one for her. Oh, I don't care about the frogs. Yeah, I actually did not get frogged once throughout this. Usually it's a problem in Titania, but uh, I, do, I do fine. Because even if you get turned into a frog, it's not that big a deal. You still do plenty of damage. Yeah, I'll help myself with that heal potion. Oh, just a blaze. Yeah, full on burst is so good for clearing enemies away from you. Which I do want to not use up too, too many of my abilities. I want to stay above 50 in case I decide to spam a Brian Act. Nice juggle. Reload before the chain expires, and just keep firing. Uh, Cyclone, not as good against Velvet, but if she decides to stay in one place and get knocked away, back. Oh, oh, she used my favorite attack against me. I'm on fire. Well, out of range on that. She's got two health bars left, but I'm getting full on back. Oh, no. And a blaze. Out oh, of range of that. Since when can she control the frogs? Nope. No healing for you. Nope. Oh, ah. Well, oh, that was embarrassing. I'm trying to get the, get the potion without getting burnt up. Not stun her, that one did. Trying to absorb Fozons, no good. Trying to heal, also no good. Goodbye. Oh, sadly I don't get it. I don't get to steal it. Next, yep. And a bugbear. Nope, this one is uh, not Oswald after the bad ending. Of course, the mountain the mountain sank. He couldn't be here. Yeah, these guys aren't too much of a problem. Nope, I think we'll just go to the other side. That was done. I have a volcano. And I'll help myself to that replacement. Yeah, I got rid of all my potions that weren't uh, level 4. At least level 4. And just while grinding up Fozons, I got a bunch of pretty much everything. I'm trying to, trying to get around these ice elementals, they're, they're the problems. And you hold still long enough for me to set you on fire. You don't move around a lot, so Blaze is a good potion. Nope, I will not talk to the hand. Oh, well, apparently you can move around that. I still guarded. All right, double fire. Oh. Well, if I get back to... If I get back to my max HP threshold, I will eat another land bone. Just one. I don't need to get to 9,000 HP. Oh, nope. Get around the swipe. And goodbye. All in all, lots of Fozons, nothing else.
Up next, oh, Wagner. Even though uh, Gwendolyn does not fight him, this should, should technically be Brigand, but now we're now we're not entirely in order. How about Mercedes can defend against all the elementals against some of the world? In fact, I may unleash a Brianak against him if I get too many elementals. Now we're just going to play tag here. Oh, well, okay. Miss me. There we go. Fly, then hold R1 to speed up. Ah, uh, let's see, but if he's going to stay in one place, he's a good target for a whirlwind. I'm saving my killer clouds for Gallon and the Dwarven battleships. I don't want to forget that blaze, but uh, not holding still. Okay, so time for the elementals. In this case, time for a Brianak. And I'm just going to skip the animation. We've seen it already. And Mercedes, I, I can't. I haven't decided if uh, Mercedes or Gwendolyn has the longer. Oh, I need to get on the ground so I can destroy these things. Oh, no! Oh, jumped right into it. There we go. Oh, it didn't quite kill him. I think he falls on his back. No more elementals at the moment. Now, if you do need a quick source of healing inside the dungeon, uh, you're getting plenty of foes on, so it's a good idea to bring some bear mess seeds, plant some sheep, as they're, de as they're pretty good for some emergency healing. But as long as you come in well stocked and well prepared, you'll be fine. Nuisance. On the other side. Yeah, I'll be using slip slide more often than the arc jump or whatever it's called. Since it's, it's usually more reliable. Yeah. Right, get out, get out of the way of the whirlwinds. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. They don't stop coming, they don't stop coming. Oh, I'm frozen, not for long. But he's down. So, uh, yeah, this is a good time to fill up a little bit. Keep the HP above the maximum. If I gain a level, I gain a level. And worst comes to worst, I can use a lamb bone to stun an enemy. Okay, there was another blaze that fell over here somewhere. There we go. Oh, hello. <laughs> Do you thank you for the six month subscription? Enjoy our continued wall meet. Oh boy. And so Phoenix Rider. This is this is gonna be one where I wanna of course take out as quickly as possible. It's gonna unleash hell. Jumping out of my killer cloud. Get back in there. This is going to be one boss I will use to free enact against, despite it's not summoning a lot of extra help for rebuild Fozons. Hey, just get in there, stay in there. I'm gonna wait for it to get further down. And unleash that attack. Can I... Nope, can't quite break it out of that one. Oh. I try to dodge one, you jump right into another. And I think we're good to finish it with a breed act. Yeah, there is that. Oh, not quite. That's okay, still got enough for. Round shot, and BAM! Lost more HP than I wanted to, but that is one of the hardest mid-bosses. Fire Spirits, uh, might as well. It'll come in handy against the Frozen Ben. And Trial Stage, who we got? Oh, Levanthan. 
Uh, we fought him as Mercedes before. It basically becomes an aerial battle. Nope. And of course, I want to knock the crown off him, keep him away from it. Especially keep him on the ground, hit him with the volcano or something. Oop. Do that again. Okay, a crown got knocked over that way. Yeah, you stay where you are, little dragon. Uh-oh, Elder Salamander is still not dead, but him away from the crown, still working. Excellent. Got a lot of damage on, on that blaze, too. Yeah. Let's try it. Let's try it. Get back in that fire. Oh. I was going to go get the crown now. a little bit tricky uh, keeping an eye which way he's facing while you're pelting with your shots, but he's the opportunity every so often. Uh, I might as well use these. Ooh, free lamp shop. And if you're lucky, yeah, you'll get it. You'll get some decent drops for healing. I may eat it just for the sake of get my HP up higher. Thank you for giving me time to reload. Did a bad spot, just Pick that up without seeing what it was. It was healing tonic. I actually got hit by him. Nope, I don't need a mini nuclear bomb. <laughs> Juggle, juggle, juggle. Okay, stay put where I can hit you with some powerful stuff. Oh, ah. That was the worst ground shot ever. Thank you for just dashing out of the way, giving me time to reload, and finish you off. Hey, you don't get a lot of photons in that fight, so I didn't want to spam attacks too much. Yeah, I can put these bones to good use. Just need a target that can get dizzy. Well, uh, speaking of... Hey, that worked. Guys, out, give me some extra foes on. Push the creeps here. Nope. Oop, he holds still. Blaze is a good one to use. Oh, yeah. Take everything down. I got most of his shots for me. Sweet. Oh, thank you for spawning right on top of the fire again. No, you stay back over there. <laughs> oh, twice. Luckiest blaze ever. Okay, 
those creeps behind me. Oh, they despawn. Well, he's got one health bar left. Now, I did say there's no point in going for S rank, but at the same time, most of these battles aren't that hard to S rank. In fact, I think the first one is probably the hardest. Because in my practice session, I didn't S rank it either, and I was playing as Cornelius. Ah, no point using a reenactor, about dead. Don't think there were any other goodies. Well, at this point, get food items. Might as well, might as well eat them for the little HP boost. Get a little experience. That's the nice thing about Mori's Bells. You just stay nicely healed up. Well beyond your max HP. Uh, seed. Yep, I maxed out. 